we are donating for Girls Who Code. This is a charity giveaway. Our goal is to just raise as much as we can for Girls Who Code, just giving women the chance to enter STEM fields. But also, I would like to give to those who do good as well. I always like to reward people who, you know, are able to get, reach into their pockets and their kindness and give. So we're giving away a whole computer. If we hit 6K, we'll give away two computers. We're giving away a TV. We're giving away two sound bars and we're giving away multiple sound unbound. So yes, we're gonna be working with our i7-12700K Intel CPU. So that's our first piece. Then we are gonna be working with our Kraken Z63 RGB. AIO cooler, it's a 200 millimeter cooler, has an LCD, LCD display. And of course, this is a all-in-one water cooler. You know, everything you need just to simply cool your system. And it is in white. This is a white cooler. And then of course, we're working with our Asus Tough Z690 motherboard. It has Wi-Fi. And thank you, thank you, thank you so so much for this DTS this is absolutely nuts so this is the motherboard that we're going to be using we're going to have four RAM slots of course we're going to be housing our i7 12700k CPU in this we'll be putting our GPU in this you know this is just layman's like if you don't know what goes into a motherboard that's what's going in our motherboard of course we have our RAM we have 32 gigs of Dominator Platinum RGB, 3600 megahertz, a gigabits per, per uh, RAM stick. It's a Dominator Corsair RAM. As you can tell, it lights up. Yeah, it, it, it lights up. It's gorgeous. Of course, when I'm not dropping my case parts, we have a terabyte of SSD memory. We have our 980 Pro, Samsung, PCIe 4.0, NVMe, M.2 SSD. And this is what we're going to be using to start our build off a terabyte of space. And then we have our gigabyte GeForce RTX 3070. Our GeForce RTX 3070 Vision GPU. So yes, we have a 3000 series GPU. It has 8 gigs of DDR, GDDR6 RAM. And that's how it looks. It's silver. Trying to hit with that white theme. It's white on the sides, silver on the front. Absolutely gorgeous. And then we have, of course, our Lian Lee Mini. Hold up, there we go. We have our Lian Lee O11 Dynamic Mini Snow Edition ATX Mid Tower Case. So it looks like this on the inside. Absolutely gorgeous. My first white build. Yeah, yeah, it's very nice. We have a couple of black parts. We have our black motherboard and our black power supply, but that's about it. Everything, has, everything else is white. That was the goal to try to get it as blank as possible. And then we have our power supply, which is way over here. Let me move all of these fans over. We have our V850 SFX gold power supply. So it's a small form factor PSU, 80 plus gold. Of course, you got 10 years and it's Cooler Master. Like, love them. They're great. So that is our power supply for our build. And then we have our fans. I'm just going to show. <laughs> we have our fans. I'm going to show one box. I have the SL120 and the SL140s. I have two SL140s and the rest our 120s because we're gonna use the 140s on our radiator and then the 120s are gonna go everywhere else so we have our 120s here and then we have our 140s and I'll show off like the stack of fans that we have so if you want to see the difference the 140s are bigger by 20 millimeters see these are our 140s and then these are our 120s and those will go throughout our computer and they will cool our system. Some of the quietest fans I have ever experienced in my life. 
Thank you so much for shouting out DTS Audio. DTS is the epitome of sound, sight, and sensing. You can find our tech in your favorite gaming equipment, consumer electronic partners, and cars to elevate the immersive experience everywhere from your home to the on to the theaters, on the go, and more. Definitely check them out. They're one of my best sponsors. I love working with them. We've worked with them for years now. I mean, they're right here in my headphones. Like, what more can I ask for? Thank you so much, DTS, for making this possible. Thank you so much, Variety Princess, for donating that 25 to Girls Who Code. You are amazing. I so appreciate you. Y'all are awesome. I know, right? Fans are important. You know, you don't want your computer to turn into a hot box. That would, that would suck. <laughs> so we just talked about our 120s and we talked about our 140 fans. And then without further ado, of course, we got our strimmers. Of course, we have our strimmers that we're gonna be using. So we have our motherboard strimmer. It's a 24 pin, 220 millimeter. So this is an extension. This is an extension of your motherboard cable and it lights up, it makes it extra pretty. And then of course you have your eight pin, 300 millimeter extension. This is for your VGA graphics card and it'll have two of those coming right off of it. That is lit. I'm gonna start by taking off the top. So I've organized most of my pieces already. If you were wondering like where I keep my screws, this is a new thing that Mango has got me doing. I put my screws in a divider and it keeps it organized. It's real, I highly recommend it. Please do that. I guess it's a bad idea to build your computers on your carpeted floors just lying around. Love to live on the static end. Yep. You know, if you're building on carpet, then I'd highly recommend that you get an anti-static bracelet. Uh, this is what mine looks like. So this is my anti-static bracelet, bracelet when I can speak. It has a metal plate in there that connects all the way to this and you just attach it to something metal. So for me, I just attach it right here to my desk or somewhere stable so it doesn't fall off. I'm gonna find a better spot eventually. But for now, we're gonna take off that filter. So these are your like dust filters. They're awesome. I love these magnetic dust filters, but make sure you clean them. Okay, we don't want a dirty filter. And then we can just slide this glass right off. So we're pulling off. See, I haven't pulled any of the plastic yet. We'll pull the plastic together. Plastic is off the front, the sides. And we are gonna need access to the GPU. So I'm gonna go ahead and take off the GPU covers right now. Look at that, isn't that gorgeous? Lian Lee Derbauer, can y'all see that? That's gorgeous, that's absolutely gorgeous. All right, so we're gonna take this shroud off as well. So this shroud is purely there to help you organize your cables. So if you have any extra thick cables that, yep, I meant that, extra thick cables that you want to organize, I'll put that there because it's a special one, then that shroud will help you organize all of that. So now nothing is impeding our view, none of that. We don't need it right now. So I'm gonna put it down and we are gonna get right into this motherboard. Thank you again, Asus. Thank you so, so much for supporting us with this build and letting us have this to give away. All right, so I popped off the CPU cover. Keep this. Whoever wins this tonight, this, keep this, okay? This is really important. Hear me right now, keep this. Because if you need to send it in for any manufacturing, anything for warranties, you need this. This is, I think it's, this is either how they verify what, or whatnot, but just, it even says it on the front, install the processor first, then remove. All right, keep the cover. So, I'm gonna go ahead, slide this out. 
Yeah, do not throw that away, it's important. Hi, Dorietta, what's going on? Welcome in. How you doing? Hope you're having a wonderful, wonderful Friday. We're doing a live build today. And we are gonna install, first things first, we're gonna install our CPU. So, I'm opening up my cover. I'm grabbing that i7-12700K. I'm kind of starting to feel the heat a little bit. I might put some music on for myself. <laughs> I don't have an accent for you. I can't even do a French accent. I can give you the omelette du fromage, and that's it. I know, I'll give you a chips back. I'm working on it. <laughs> omelette du fromage, I learned that from Dexter. Aren't y'all impressed? Are y'all not impressed? Cafe au lau. I'll, uh, yeah, I don't even know how to say that word. You know, I'm American. <laughs> yeah, I, nope, nope. I don't know how to say none of that. I'm just so American when a hardware and a software love each other very much. Hey, Root. So the great thing about these uh, 12 series CPUs is that you don't have to look for the corner anymore. Uh, it's really... It's really jarring for me because I'm so used to matching everything to the corner of the motherboard. No, you just match the notches. So, please, if you are an AMD user, please, please, please be gentle. You should always be gentle with your CPUs, but these Intel CPUs, they're just meant to float. You're supposed to just let it, don't drop it. Just put it on and let it be, all right? Once it fits the notches, you just let it be. Hey, Mester, um, if you donate anything, you are eligible to win a DTS Sound Unbound code. We have tiered giveaways. So at 25, you're eligible for a sound bar. 50, you're eligible for a TV. And 100, you are eligible for the computer that I'm building for you right now. And this all, all of it goes to girls who code thanks to DTS, thanks to ASUS, and thanks to Vizio for making this charity possible. So our CPU, I'm hoping, oh, let me make sure that it's focused. There we go. I think you guys can see it pretty clearly from there. So you see how these notches, and I'm gonna add some more light right here. Hopefully that's clear. And if we need more, I'll just use my phone. So these notches have lined up here and the, the CPU is sitting nicely. It's sitting undisturbed, minding its business, drinking its tea even, just, just sitting here waiting to be locked in. So once you do that, you just take that bar. Yes, it is going to feel heavy, but you just press right on it and now that CPU is locked in. We are not gonna install our RAM this time. Usually I install RAM, but we have the NZXT AIO and I want to have as much room as I can to install that. So we'll be installing our RAM later. So we are going to install our bracket and this is our bracket here. This is what's going to hold that pump in. So we have our bracket and we have our 1700 Intel standoffs. So it's very important that you get the standoffs right for your bracket. There are AM4 brackets and then there's Intel brackets. So this is the 1700 brackets that are meant for the 12th gen CPUs. So make sure you keep track of those. And remember, when I give this computer away, all of the extra parts, you're receiving all of the, I'm not gonna just give you what's in the computer. You're getting all the extra stuff. So if you would like to switch to some parts around or if you'd like to customize, You'll have everything that we received so you're able to do whatever you like with this build. I, I highly encourage that you get to play around with the computer at least once in your life so you know what it's all about. Hey, House of Doggis, what's going on? Welcome in. How you doing? Yeah, yeah. If you are on mobile, please get to a computer. The Twitch charity tool is not yet implemented for mobile. It is biased towards our PC users. <laughs> it's fun. So right now I'm screwing in the standoffs for the 
AIO bracket. We're just gonna twist that in. Remember, if you are a code breaker, you can also request music. So if there's a, if you guys want to get a vibe going, you know, if you wanted to look, you want to hear a certain thing, do that. Request it. It's just exclamation SR. I can't believe we're at 55. Y'all are wild. If we hit 6K, we are less than $500, less than $500 from $6,000. We'll be giving away another unicorn. All right, it is okay if this bracket is just a little loose, just make sure all of the standoffs are tight. So we've installed the standoffs and now we are going to install our SSD. So that 980 Pro that I pulled out earlier, we are going to install that. I'm gonna take off the closest PCIe cover here. Need a smaller bit. That speed build, Chelsea, speed build. Whoa, you think you found one for Donald? Oh, you got it. Come on, you could get it. Hey, we are giving out more DTS Sound Unbound codes, so everybody has a chance to bring something home today. We'll be giving out more than what I initial, I think we're giving out more than the initial five. So this is the M.2 cover. I'm just taking that off so I can install this SSD. All right, now that I actually have the motherboard in my hand or around me, I'm gonna put this on. Just a little paranoid. I remember I made a YouTube, I did a build video on YouTube and one guy was like that is so completely useless you don't you don't need that it, it, you're fine you're fine you don't need that it's, it's it's a it's a gimmick I'm like are you serious <laughs> static is real like people can short stuff out so this is the SSD that we're gonna be working with and we're gonna install that so we're just gonna take so what's really cool about these new motherboards is that you don't need the SSD screw anymore. Like they have a built-in screw that you can just use to slide on it. Like it slides around it and locks it in. And it is the most convenient update I have had in a long time. Thank you. Thank you for doing that because having to look for that tiny screw and then dropping the screw and then crying when you strip or lose the screw because it's so delicate, bro. So with these, uh, with these SSDs, you don't slide them in directly. You, so did you see that? I hope you saw it. So I go in at like a, let's say like 40 degree angle. Like it's, it's just an angle, like a 45 degree angle. You don't slide it in vertically. You go in at a 45 degree angle. You see how it's kind of raised up here. I'm at a little more light so you can see it. If that, if that even helped. Yeah, so this is raised up and then you push it down. You push it down so it greets that screw. All right, so we're gonna twist that out and then just like that, it's in. Look at how easy that is. That is just so, I love it, I love it. That is my favorite update. Like it just takes so many tears away. So now that our M.2 is installed, we're just gonna go in, put the cover right back on, make sure our screws line up. I like using my fingers. And we're just gonna screw everything right back in with our fingers and then follow through with our screwdriver. Here we go. You can make life a little easier if you use the bracelet on your, that's very true. Mister, oh my gosh. Mister, thank you so much. Thank you for the the hundred. Are we at five six fifty five? Destroying the master. Thank you so much for the hundred. You are awesome. I so appreciate you. Thank you all for killing these goals today. I, bro, can I? I'm gonna cry later. Can I do that? 
Right, less than 350 bucks to hit 6K so we can unlock another unicorn. And this is for all of my $100 donors, for everybody who donates 100 on this giveaway. You will be eligible for the next giveaway when we, I'm just gonna say it, when we hit 6,000. When we hit 6,000. That is not sitting the way I want it to sit. Hold on. It's really easy to miss these screws. Let me make sure I'm lined up. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Yes, you're right, gargle salt is bad for a lot of parts on your PC. Uh, you wanna go and just start eroding away your stuff, get some salt. All right, so we have installed the CPU, we have installed the AIO cooler bracket, and we have installed the SSD. We've stripped the case. We've stripped the case. So we've gone and we removed the top, the glass, the GPU cover. I removed the GPU cover, right? I did, and I took off the back and the shroud. So now that we've worked in our SSD, I'm gonna put all of my extra space over here. And there's one thing that we have to do. So I'm gonna move the motherboard over to the side. Since we have an ATX motherboard, and Teddy, ha Teddy put a great tip in, you can put these bracelets on your ankle so you don't even have to look at it. It just makes it that much easier. Teddy's absolutely right. So we have an extension for our case because we have an ATX motherboard. And that is important because if we were to install the case as is, I'm gonna make sure that we can see it all. If we were to install the case as is, we would only have six standoffs and that's not enough to hold it up. So we wanna make sure everything is secured in. We're gonna put that extension in here and we are going to install with these F screws. When I get, there we go. Always keep, put your tools back where you, you got them the first time. So we're gonna install these screws here. I think the instructions call them F screws. We're gonna put the extension in there and this will allow us to have the extra room that we need to install our ATX motherboard. Now, I highly recommend that if you get screwdrivers to build, make sure they are magnetic at least. Uh, getting a powered screwdriver might change your life. I had one. <laughs> And now I can never use it again. It's unfortunate. Trooper! Pist Wait! Pistol! With the hundred? Yo, Ray! With the fit! Onyx? How you doing, Onyx? Thank you so much for the sub! Right? Laugh now, cry later. Ray! Thank you for the 50. Pistol, thank you for the hundred. You are awesome! I appreciate you. How you doing? Thank you so much for supporting Girls Who Code. Thank you so, so much for the love. This charity is possible through ASUS DTS, Vizio, and other partners. Y'all are lit. We are, two, we are less than 200 away. And there's that extension. See, we just added that quick extension in there. That extension is in, so now we can install our motherboard. I'm just gonna take this, I'm gonna slide it in. So we are gonna have to use some elbow grease here. Uh, not every motherboard uh, is gentle. Sometimes you gotta give it, you know, a little elbow. A little tough love, that's what I like to call it. Pistol, I hope you're having a great Friday. Thank you for being so generous. Since you've donated $100, you are eligible for this computer that we are building right now. We are doing a giveaway at the end of the stream. And if we hit 6,000, I'll be giving away another build of another unicorn in two weeks and y'all are eligible. Everybody who's donated 100, you are eligible for that next giveaway. So please stick around, we'll gather the parts, we'll show off the, the PC part picker list and we'll do another build live just like this for our donors. Thank you so, so much. I know y'all are freaking awesome, holy crap. So we have some motherboard screws. We're gonna need about nine of them. And we're gonna try to stick with silver. I'm gonna try to stick with the silver 
screws that came with this case. So I'm going to start at the bottom and work my way up to the top. There we go. <laughs> yeah, you know, Cuervo, that's not a bad idea. My streaming computer is built on AMD. I, I very much appreciate an AMD build. Uh, I can let y'all vote, actually. Um, if you want to pick the next build, I think you should join the Discord and we'll hop into Codebreaker HQ and have you guys vote on what the next build should be based around, what parts and whatnot, but I'll, I'll keep the same theme. It'll still be a unicorn. Cool? Thank you, Teddy, for pulling it up. Hey, Odias! What's going on? How you doing? I can't believe I missed you. Oh, oh my God! Wait, 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 wait. Did you like, you meant that? You meant that? Was that like, was that for here? Or do I need to put it there? No, 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 no. Bango, Bango, please, can you handle that? <laughs> Thank you for killing the goal. Thank you. No, we got you, we got you, we got you. It's, uh, everybody, if you are donating, we are going through our Twitch charity tool. I know Odias is like that. I know Odias is built like that. I'm just gonna say that we hit the 6K. Yo, wow! <laughs> no, no! <laughs> Wait, but you meant, the oh my God. Oh my God. Yo! <laughs> right, Static? I, you know, some people just be like, real, and I'm just like, oh my God. <laughs> oh dear. I can't cry over this build, okay? I will literally put salt all over it. Oh my God, right? He said, don't tell me what to do. I'm just saying, I'm always ready to accommodate, all right? I don't play with people's money. Thank you, OTS, for killing the goal. And everybody who donated to make it possible. Holy crap. This is real, this is really happening. Okay. Uh. <laughs> to that 7k goal for Teddy. <laughs> oh my god. They are beat. Thank you so much, Odias, for donating to Girls Who Code so we can get more women to do things like this and more. Y'all are, y'all are a force of nature. A week, not even a full week. Five days. And not even five days. Y'all really only donated when I was live. You're telling me that in less than 24 hours, right? Because we have not even streamed for 24 hours. In less than 24 hours, y'all pulled together $6,000. Amazing. Amazing. Y'all are, y'all are amazing. I mean, listen to Odias. Listen, OD is $10. It's, it's, it's to, we don't have to stop here. It's to something good. It's to something good. We're putting in our coin for y'all. We are now gonna go ham, buy all new parts, and we are gonna build up a new computer for you guys out of our pot. Since you guys hit our 6K goal, you guys can pick the parts in the Discord. Everybody who's donated 100 plus is eligible for that giveaway because you guys made it possible. Thank you so, so much. Yo!
gotta stop. I gotta stop. I gotta stop. I gotta stop. Y'all are, y'all are, y'all are wild. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. Thank you for the generous donations. Oh my Lord. Oh my days. I, oh my God, 64. Oh, oh, okay. I'm staying away from all the parts. Thank you for doing good. I'm already so like, it is really hard for me to ask for money. So the fact that y'all are like coming through right now, I know y'all, I always knew y'all could, but oh my God. Thank you all so much. Ray, why? Cuervo, Flicker, D Horwitz for coming back to back with the hundreds. Y'all are amazing. Thank you so much. Y'all, okay. I have, I was supposed to do, this is supposed to be a speed build. Oh, okay. The motherboard is installed. <laughs> oh, okay. Y'all serious? Oh, what? Wait, y'all. Y'all. <laughs> oh my god. Y'all are gonna make me blow up. I'm sorry. Wait. Static. Psychotic bat. Wait. Wait, y'all, thank you. Thank you so much. I just, I just, I gotta breathe. I gotta breathe. <sighs> Holy fuck. Thank you. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> We're supposed to be doing stuff. We're supposed to. Thank you so much for being so generous. Thank you for trying to make me cry. Thank you for doing such good with your... Thank you for making me forget what I was supposed to do next. We installed the motherboard. We we installed the, the screws. We got to do the case. All right, so now that the motherboard's in, y'all, and I'm, I'm, I'm falling apart, but, but the case is holding together. We're going to do the case the case what are these the case cables yeah them things we're gonna do the cables because y'all are wild thank you is that a 25 thank you so much amazing for the 25 thank you so so much y'all are awesome please 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 donate in our chat thank you for being so so generous and making this one of our um, one of the most amazing charity meets we've done this year. Y'all are nuts. Y'all are absolutely nuts. <sighs> Chaotic! Look what y'all did! Chaotic! That's like the third one! Y'all are great! Oh my god, I know this mic is peaking. I know this mic. I'm gonna try to talk calmly. Chaotic, thank you for the hundred. I know, right? Static, just keep building. Okay. I'm just gonna go as fast as I can. So this is our HD audio. We gotta put this one through the bottom. I know this for a fact, cause it's always at the bottom, at least in my experience. I'm gonna snake this through. <sighs> Sadist. Thank you. Thank you so much. Believe it or not, it's a good kind of pain I'm going through today. It does hurt. It does hurt. I haven't slept in days. So I hope this is uh, somewhat enjoyable. <laughs> Y'all are killing it. 6,800, bro. Your donos are giving me life. Bro, yo, if we hit... Should we do a third? Since y'all are like popping off. I don't know. It's just a thought. It's just a thought. I could do, I feel like I could do a third. At like 10, maybe. Cause y'all are killing it. <laughs> <laughs> and 
There's nothing wrong with doing a third. I have no issue building these back to back. Like, please. You hit six, we're doing two. Eight? Eight? A third? Eight? <sighs> My God. <sighs> I'll have to talk to Mango. I'll have to talk to Mango because you know how he is. He's like, Chelsea, 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 chill. Chill. Chill, Chelsea, chill. Bro. Okay. Well, I'm saying, while I'm saying, I'm gonna plug this in. We're just plugging in our lightning and our USB ports. Let me make sure I'm actually doing it in the right direction. Shouldn't be twisted. Yes, it is. I like to put things in backwards, apparently. That is our case USB. So we're plugging in all the stuff that goes into the front of our case. What did Nikki say? That's how mango sounds? Fix the, yeah. Yeah, Nikki, he sounds just like that. The price just went up. <laughs> he never sang, he never sang for y'all. You're right. He could go on the mic and sing for y'all. He really could because he can turn on the mic and he can sing for y'all like right now. He surely can. I'm glad you pointed that out. I'm about to put in the HD audio here. Just making sure that it's all lined up. And then I'm gonna try to build this as fast as I can because it's 409 and we do have a long way to go. So I might put on some screamo music for me and then start popping off for y'all. Oh, there we go. Okay, yeah, it was in the right slot. All right, be nice, slide in, boom. Don't be scared to put pressure on your parts. I mean, of course, make sure you're plugging things in the right spot, but do not be scared to also open the manual, okay? It's okay to open the manual. I just wanna get a look at that F panel. Where are you at? Even though you normally know what goes where, it's always good to check. All right, so this, is a, this can be a pain point for some people putting in the HDD, the power LEDs, and the power switch. 50? Hyrule! Thank you! Your ride is here, Teddy. We'll be here. Ride safe, Teddy. I'll see you soon. 50? Thank you so much. OD is like, just a dollar. <laughs> I appreciate y'all so much for hyping up this charity. It means the world to me. Thank you for all of my cheer, my cheer squad in the chat. Y'all are awesome. Y'all are freaking awesome. All right, so we're gonna put the ones on the bottom here. And we're gonna put our LEDs here. It goes plus, positive, then negative. Let's make sure my depth perception is up to par. Yep, those are lined up. And then we're gonna put in the power switch, positive and negative as well. So now our power switch, our HDD, and our LEDs, all our LEDs should light up. And that should be it for all of the case. Tables. Oh, I am I am okay. I am okay. I am not shaking. I am not shaking. You're fine. You're fine, bro. You're fine. Everything is good. Everything's perfect. Everything is perfect because your community is perfect. Like you don't have to be nervous. <sighs> okay. Let's uh start wrapping some. We're just putting some of this up ready for wrap. All right, we plugged in the case cables. So now it's time to install the power supply. That is always fun. So we're gonna make some room for us. I'm gonna put this right back up here, or I'm gonna put it down here because it's basically empty. We're gonna grab our power supply. Fairy Mod Mother! You're here? You're, you're here? Hi, I remember what. I'm not gonna cry. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Thank you so much. We were just in here, you know, 
just raising money for Girls Who Code and y'all just came through. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> thank you so much. Y'all are awesome. Y'all are so freaking awesome. Thank you, dude. Hi, Fairy Mod Mother. Hi, Twitch. Hey, Ray. It's so great to see you. Oh, no, you. No, you. We were just trying to speed build a computer so we could give it away. Thank you. Thank you so much, Poodle. And they went way over our goal. Like, we were just raising like a thousand dollars. And now we're at like almost seven. Oh, oh my God. We, we cried. Wow. <laughs> Thank you so, so much for the Twitch raid. You have a magical. Fairy Mod Mother! Thank you for the 50! You were awesome! Oh my gosh! Everybody, please thank the Fairy Mod Mother for coming through and just blessing the chat with their magic. Please, please thank our Fairy Mod Mother. Hey, Summer. Welcome in. Thank you for the smiles, thank you for the magic, and thank you for the Twitch magic. This is just, this is, oh my God. Oh man, this is, this has to be a moment, right? We gotta make this a moment. Ugh, I'm, oh my gosh. I'm such a bad crier, I'm gonna be honest. I'm such a bad crier. <laughs> thank you, Jay. Thank you, Sir Jed. Y'all are amazing. Thank you so, so much for the love. We're gonna keep building. We're, I promise we're gonna keep building. It is so hard, but we're gonna keep building. And I'm gonna make this a moment. Oh, this is, this is awesome. Here you go, everybody. If you were here, you were a part of it. You were a part of that moment. Please, please, please claim your moment because y'all are, y'all are freaking amazing. Thank you for the love. We are building a whole computer for Girls Who Code, and we are giving it away to our donors who have donated for our DTS Vizio Aces charity campaign. We've been streaming all week. It has been a wild ride. <laughs> it has been, I've been up every night. Uh, we'd be going to bed at like 3 a.m. and we wake up at nine just to make sure everything was together. The stream had to be perfect. We had to make sure all of our parts were perfect. We went and we had to go get extras and things just to make sure it all looked good. <gasps> Bro, wait. Oh my gosh, Alons. Thank you so much. Thank you for supporting Girls Who Code Alons. Thank you. I, I cry happy tears. I promise y'all I'm happy. Y'all are awesome. It is so great to meet y'all. Thank you for joining us. Thank you Twitch so much for highlighting our stream today and just doing good on a Friday. I promise you, I'm gonna, I'm gonna speed demon through this, but please claim your moment. If you were a part of it, it was so great having y'all here in the chat. Whew, okay, we're doing it, we're doing it. Uh, the power supply, the power supply. <laughs> oh my God, where, where, is, where is anything right now? Y'all wiped my brain. Anything, it, it could be up anywhere. Okay, nothing's over here. So it's all gotta be over here. Oh, I'm so turned around. Okay, Chelsea, breathe, there it is. All right, so I'm gonna put my fans on the side so I don't forget where they are. We're gonna get our <laughs> Cooler Master. Yeah, girls will be coded, you right. We're getting our V850 SFX gold power supply. Yes, the cables are daunting but we are dauntless. All right, so yes, it is tiny. This is, this is a little baby, this is a little bean baby, but it packs a punch. It's gonna be perfect, so it gives you a little less weight on your mini 011 Dynamic Leanne Lee case. We're gonna put our cables together. Oh my, you're a girl coder too. Hey Natty, it's so great to see you. My favorite languages are C++ and Java. They are awesome. No, I have not learned Python. I've never had to use it, but one day I will. My favorite IDE is Eclipse. One day I'll grow up and be a full stack developer, front end and back end for web development. Thank you, I appreciate you for that support. 
Thank you so, so much, Ray, for that love. You are awesome. Thank y'all for being so generous and supporting Girls Who Code. So we are going to install this power supply right here on this back plate. I'm going to try to be a professional and keep it trucking. How wild would that be if I finished this by five? Like we just started like, what, an hour ago? I don't know how long this stream is. Cuervo, Bay, thank you both for the 25s. Y'all are awesome. Thank you so, so much. I, I am speechless at this point. Things are wild. You work at JavaScript and React. You are, you are truly, you, is your workflow agile? I just wanna know. Are you sprinting every week? Because I just feel like you are, daddy. Bay Cuervo, thank you so, so much for destroying that goal. Wow, I think we might be getting towards a third computer. Since we hit 6K, we are now giving away two computers. We are considering giving, giving away a third computer. People are doing it. Alans, they're, they're a whole other level. And I'm gonna turn this over so you guys can actually see me screw this in. Or, yeah, let me start with one screw and then we'll pop in on that part. All right. So let's do this. Shout out to Ray, love that guy. It's always great seeing them. I hope you're having a wonderful day. And let's not install this backwards, baby. There we go. I know you're tired. I know you were, you're excited, but we're gonna do this right. All right, pointing the fan away from all the sensitive motherboard parts and whatnot. I'm gonna place it out towards the outside of the case. I know, right? Exactly. Modern Meerkat, that's it. Hey, Mercy! Thank you! Thank you for the hundred! Oh my God! Oh, I'm gonna break this mic. I truly am. I am going to break this mic. Thank y'all so much. It's so great to see y'all. Thank you for chatting in here. Thank you so, so much, Noobtastic. It has been a wild day. The fairy mod mother blessed us with some subs. Bless their souls. They made me cry. Twitch came in here and shared their community. I hope they had a wonderful stream. We love sharing our bits and our bites here. Thank y'all for the love. Yeah, I'm always peeking my mic, bro. It's impossible for me not to. I thought I was gonna be calm and collected, but yeah, not, absolutely not. Oh, Teddy has done a backflip, for sure. Teddy's doing a backflip, thousand percent. Teddy made this happen and so did y'all. Thank you so, so much for killing it. Uh, I'm gonna wait for Mango to finish his meeting and I'll ask if he's down for the third computer at 8K. I, I mean, why not, right? He's supposed to sing for y'all too, so I do have to get him in here to sing. Oh! Oh! I mean, if Mango says so, Mango can sing, yeah. Guys, AK, third computer. Y'all down? He, he, Bye, Fairy Mod Mother. Thank you so much for the love. And thank you for the sub. I see y'all. Thank you so much, Natty, for joining the Bite Command. It is so great to have you. For the funky mother who's repping computer science. Look at y'all. There is definitely a love-hate relationship with JavaScript. It's, it's just the truth. Thank you so much, Nemis, for supporting Girls Who Code. We so appreciate every donation. Y'all are awesome. Y'all have less than a thousand. Less than, less than 900 to get to that. I'll give away three computers for everyone who's donated 100 bucks. To be eligible for the PC giveaway, you'll have to donate $100 between now and the next giveaway. I think we'll, we'll discuss the rules, but for today, we're definitely giving away a computer today. We'll be giving away a computer for everybody who's donated $100 to Girls Who Code. We could keep this charity up and we could let people do more good, but 
As of today, this is our giveaway day. We're giving away a computer. We're giving away a TV, a 50 inch TV provided by Vizio and sound bars also provided by Vizio. And we're also giving away some DTS sound unbound codes as well. It's gonna be lit. I'm, I'm super psyched. Thank you so much, Tom, for donating the five to Girls Who Code. Y'all are y'all are freaking awesome. Oh, donate to to the charity. Do not donate to me. I'm gonna dis. I'm gonna take that command off. Actually, uh, be aware not to don't use the Twitch charity tool. So Twitch has made this amazing tool that lets you donate directly in Twitch. So we can kind of avoid this confusion. Um, just press donate. If you are on mobile, you have to get on a computer so you can throw your, your funds that way. But absolutely hop in on your PC and donate there. Thank you so much, Mango, for pulling up how to donate. Is it really a vacuum cleaner? Hey, Tom, thank you for sharing all that love. I appreciate y'all and thank you for the hype. Oh my gosh, okay. So this is what, I get distracted very easily. So I'm gonna throw on my buds. I'm gonna still talk to y'all, of course. But I'm gonna throw on my buds. So I can get some focus music on and stop crying every five seconds. Yeah, yeah, I know. We are, we are, we are browser biased here, but don't worry. We'll be up for a while. And this charity, I think we could keep this going for a bit. So there's always time to give. Let me put this on. I'm going I'm to put on some focus music for me because the way, <laughs> oh my God, I'm having a meltdown on the inside. You want some TIG? You want some 10 GBE? You want all of that? Quite well, join the Discord and we can talk about it. So we're going to be deciding on the build. We're going to be deciding on the next build, on the next unicorn in the Discord and what parts you guys would like. Yes, thank you so much, DTS. We're throwing in another 10 at 8K, so 20 codes total. Y'all are wild, and y'all made it happen. All right, I'm gonna focus now. So now that we've put in the PSU, we're gonna screw this in and we're gonna plug in all the cables one at a time so it stays organized because the worst thing you can do is just plug in all the cables and you have no sense of organization so i think i'm going to start with if i could get the cpu yes perfect so i'm going to start with the cpu cables because we have to snake them in at the top and i think we need two of them for this motherboard you know we got to feed our cpu Okay, good energy. All right. Chelsea, you've done this stuff before. Let's do it fast, because these people want to win this. Let's not hold them up. That's our SATA. I believe this is, this is the PCIe. We'll get to that next, PCIe. And this should be our CPU, absolutely. All right, I'm just snaking the CPU cables through the front because then we're gonna go ahead and plug it in into the motherboard. Kinda get as much work done before we start putting in fans and other per other things. All right. Hope everybody had their coffee, because man, I've been up. <laughs> Thanks, Cuervo. All right, thank you so much, Tooth, for the 75. Bro, I, ugh, it's unreal, all right? If I look like I'm shaking, no, I didn't. No, no, I don't. I don't look like I'm shaking, I promise. All right, so we have our two PCIe cables, but we'll get to those. First thing we're gonna do, I'm gonna plug in the CPU and then yank those cables back so that they're clean. So we've got eight here, and then we've got four on the side. I'm gonna try to clean that up just a little bit so it looks decent when we plug it all in. There we go, slide in from the bottom. There it is, there it is. 
plug that CPU in, and then plug the four, and we can move on. Just doing everything on the power supply at the moment. So then we can move on to all the other stuff. It's not in the back. Oh man, thank you so much, Ebony Juggernaut. Thank you so, so much for that donation. I like the case with, oh, you like the case, the PSU is behind the, yes. Indigo, that's always nice. So when it comes to small form factor builds, uh, it's nice to have the power supply so close to everything. So having it behind everything is very useful and it helps with dissipating heat. So it's away from all the stuff you wanna keep cool. Yes, Will, we went from like five to seven K. Absolute, just wild, wild, Will. It's great to see you, how you doing? Is it bad that I put together my PC on your... It's not bad, it's not bad. I mean, you know, as long as you were grounded and you didn't uh, drop anything. I mean, it's it's just unstable, like it's risky. Like how, how was it putting screws in? Sounds fun. Sounds comfy like a like a sleepover. Okay, I'm going to start from this side actually. And then we're going to squeeze this in. Oh, actually, yeah. So I'm going to wait. Yeah, I'm just I'm not going to slide this through because we're going to be putting our trimmers in. But I am just going to plug the motherboard in. This motherboard cable in. No, I'm gonna wait on that because it's at the edge. The next thing we're gonna do are the PCIe. Let's do those PCIe cables. I am sweating, I am crying. Hi, I'm, I'm tired, I'm happy, it's wild. Hey, how you doing? Welcome in. What's going on? We're doing a build and we are giving this build away today to a lucky $100 donor who has helped destroy our charity goals. Honestly, you guys went ham. We're giving away 10 DTS Sound Unbound codes at 20. We are gonna give away 20 codes at 8K. And if we hit 8K today, we'll, give, we'll be giving away three computers total. We'll be giving away our first one today and then our next two in the next couple of weeks if we hit 8K. We are already giving away an extra computer because we've hit 7,000 or 6,000. We hit 6,000 and we're giving away another. At eight, we'll be giving away another one. Just call me DJ Khaled because we're giving away another one. <laughs> Happy birthday. Oh my gosh. Happy birthday to your mom. I hope they're doing well. I hope they're having a wonderful time. My sister's birthday is tomorrow. So I know she is having, she's all prepped. Is your mom a Virgo? Because you know their birthdays have to be perfect. I'm gonna go ahead and put in Sata right now. And this is where, this is really important. It's very important that you keep everything organized everything cabled up and that's what this shroud is for we have three of these velcro and we're going to use them they're going to hold everything together so i'm going to go ahead and plug in the motherboard yeah i'm going to plug in the motherboard cables here and i believe those are all the cables we're going to need for today's build we only need one sata because it has four sata ports coming off of it Remember, if you're a code breaker, you can request music if you'd like to set the vibe for today's stream. Bird up? No, not bird up. My, my other sister, the second oldest, her birthday is this weekend, and I know she, she wanted to go to a Brazilian steakhouse, so I hope they uh, get her a reservation. I made some recommendations. Welcome in. I hope you're having a good one. All right, I'm putting this uh, power supply box away. So now that we've installed the PSU, we put in the cables. We're gonna tie some of these down with some of the plastics that we have. These are very useful. 
These are very useful. I recommend keeping these so you can keep your cables organized. Also pay attention to the orientation of your cables. The way your cables go in matter. If it's laying on top of another cable, it's gonna cause disarray. So that's why I always build my cables from the bottom up. So everything is layered. I mean, it's gonna be layered anyway, but start from the bottom, work your way up so nothing's wrapped over and try to keep them in their own lane. You're hurting snakes, if that makes sense. You're, you're definitely hurting some snakes. So now that we've done that, we are gonna go ahead and we're gonna install our strimmers. So these strimmers, never seen a strimmer before. Yes, it's the shiny package. Look at that, so shiny. They're gonna bring that extra pizzazz. They're basically extensions for your motherboard cable and your VGA cables. And what we're gonna do, our motherboard cable is gonna go through this top rubber space here. And then, let me make sure that's in right, perfect. Our motherboard cable is gonna come in through the top space. And this is gonna come through behind, so make sure that this cable is the one plugging into your power supply, this, this side of that cable. Happy birth, thank you so much, Will. I'll be sure to let them know. I'll be sure to let my sister know. Thank you so much for the birthday support. Thank you, K-Dot, how you doing? We're just building a whole computer in here, you know, no biggie. We're doing it for charity. My org DTS, they came through and we've been doing a week campaign with Girls Who Code, with Asus, with Vizio. We did an unboxing of a TV. We, we're gonna be giving away a whole bunch of stuff today. We're giving away a whole computer. We're giving away two computers now because they hit 6,000. If they hit 8K, we're giving away a third. And then we're also giving away some sound bars and DTS Sound Unbound Codes. We're giving away Timnos now. And we'll be giving away 20 at 8K because y'all are just popping off. So we want to keep these cables organized. I tie them off with these plastics so I know which one is which and I'll be able to bend them appropriately. So that strimmer is there. We're going to bring that small cable through because we're going to have to plug this into the strimmer box later. So there's that. Let me know if I'm too loud or if I'm ever peeking way too much because this is a different mic setup for me. Thank you. Yeah, so this build is called the unicorn. And you're gonna see why when we boot it up. So this is our VGA strimmer. We're gonna put this one in the bottom because we want it to reach our GPU. And don't be scared, again, do not be scared to put pressure on these parts. You need to really use your elbows and your fingers because new parts will fight you. Hey, yeah, this is my first white build. It's my very first white build. Yes, I would love it if you're present for the raffles. It makes it easier for me to give away so I can grab your information and everything that I need to send everything. And it makes, you know, it's that community building for sure. So please, please, please be around. I'm hoping to be done with this build by 530. God willing. 5.30 Central, so if you have to go do something, yeah, go take a break, get some snacks, go run some errands. Around 5.30, 6 p.m. Central, I think we'll be starting those giveaways up, but we will be giving the computer away uh, last, last, so you'll have time to get back, I promise. I'm very, very excited to see who wins because you guys are some of the most generous people I've ever met. Y'all are amazing. How you doing, K-Dot? How's your day? Did anybody get DreamCon tickets? I got some today. Am I gonna see y'all next year at DreamCon? All right, so we installed the strimmers. So now we are going to install the AIO pump and the radiator. So that means we need to do the radiator on this side. See how those strimmers are just waiting to be used. All right, I'm just gonna be gentle here. And we're gonna get that pump now. All right, so here's our pump. 
and here's our radiator. And we're gonna do this configuration. I'm gonna turn it, not that one. How do I want it? This is honestly the hardest part for me most times. I'm like, how do I want it to look? So we're gonna slide this in, and this is why I put the strimmers in first, because now we can easily modify these parts, push them around before we screw everything in. So everything has room to sit nicely. And I think that's pretty nice right there. You're gonna be standing outside. Oh my God, no. Static. Come on, y'all need to come to Austin. And it's finally in Austin. Actually, how do I, how did I want this? I wanted it this way, but I feel, there we go. Okay, yeah, my brain was doing weird stuff. My brain was doing stuff there, I, I was, Yo, I am scatterbrained today. Okay, so we're gonna sit those cables right there so we can get the least bubbles possible. The least, we're gonna get bubbles, but the least. And then those ports are gonna come out this way. So I'm just gonna sit this here for now. We won't screw anything in yet. And then we're gonna put the paste on before we screw anything in. And I'm gonna get the bolts ready. Yeah, we're definitely doing paste. I just wanna make sure that I have my configuration done. So we have our pump bolts here, and then we are gonna put in our radiator fans, but first we're gonna screw this in before we put our fans on, our Lee and Lee fans. We're not gonna be using the NZXT base fans, we're gonna be replacing them with the 140s that I showed y'all earlier. So normally you would get pump fans with the NZXT Kraken pump, but we're gonna replace them with our 140s this time around so everything can match. <laughs> Y'all could just stay home and go over there. Yeah, you're right. Ray, you're right. I could just walk over there. But I bought tickets. And I can just go home after. I've never been to a fancy little convention like DreamCon before. I'm hype, I'm hype. It's gonna be great. Get to see all my friends who made it. I'm gonna have to make some extra visits for the friends who didn't. But actually, before I plug or, or screw this in, I'm gonna make sure the strimmer is where I need it to be because I don't want it sticking out like this. I kind of, well, it's still white. Actually, no, that might actually be ideal. That might not be that bad, okay. I'm happy with the strimmers where they are for now. I'm gonna go ahead, put the paste on. We're gonna go ahead and take this tape off because we know we need to include all of the cables before we start it up. Please take off any tape you see. Sometimes tape can be hard to see. So just pay extra attention to everything. Scratch on some stuff, uh, especially when it comes to those M.2 slots. Peel the tape underneath it. That tape is off. And we're gonna be using my own Noxua NTH2 10G thermal paste, or 10 grams, that's really all it is. It's just my favorite paste at the moment. So we are going to apply just a small dot right onto the CPU. All right, can y'all, I hope y'all can see it. Pretty sure. Y'all can see that now. Give it a little bit of light. Oh, not that much light. There we go. I might, let me blow this out real quick. Hey Amari, what's good? How you doing? I'm just dropping cables everywhere. What's going on? How's your day? We're building a computer and I'm trying to speed build it. I got, I got so distracted. So distracted. I cried a few times. It was great. All right, we're gonna blow these lights out as best as I can. Perf. All right. So just a dot, nothing wild, the size of a pea. 
I like to give a little more because of the how long this uh, 12th gen CPU is so just to make sure it's completely covered but don't overthink it don't overthink it if you're somebody who puts an X on there you know do that that's okay There's nothing wrong with that so now we're just going to slot this over and when we turn every thong, everything on, the heat will do the rest. Oh my God. I'll eventually learn how to speak. All right, let's start screwing it in. I like to screw everything in diagonally. You know what I said, Demo. No, I didn't go to DreamCon this year. I will be going next year. The tickets just dropped today and we secured some tickets. They uh, changed up the ticket process. And it's in Austin, so I don't have to go far. <laughs> Thanks, Demo. Wow, okay, guys. Hey, Snyder, how you doing? Welcome in. Apply the entire tube. You want the extra squish and for it to cover every pin on the motherboard. So nothing, at please don't do that, I will cry. I will literally cry if you do that. I would, I would cry for real. <sighs> so everybody went ham on the charity today. Thank you so, so much for the love. Y'all are freaking awesome. Thank you, Snyder. I uh, do need to put on my, uh, I get comfortable. I do need to put my anti-static bracelet on. Sure, there's no power running through it, but it may be a wood floor as well, but you know, let's not risk it. So just, just throw your bracelet on and then we'll tighten every screw. I think I'm gonna need my bigger one. <laughs> yeah, static, we're anti-static in these parts. Thank you, Tiger. I appreciate that. You know, it's been a long week. My hair, it, it uh, it's feeling it. But we're doing it. Oh my God. Do you want, do we need to be present? Yes, yes. Uh, try to be here around 5.30, 6 p.m. Central. It, it's very, it's very, uh, anticlimactic to be like hey they won the giveaway all right next part you know i want y'all to react and i want to grab your information as soon as possible so we can hop on it i'd like to ship these out by next week any gift that we need to ship out i'd like to have it you know locked in as soon as possible so 5 36 stick around for then if you're not here for the giveaway i'm not gonna remove you until the very end if you're eligible for any part and you just don't show up, uh, I'll keep pulling your name unless you specifically say, I'm, I don't want it, or, or it's the last giveaway. So we'll keep you. Yeah, I know, chaotic, I know. I, I keep getting distracted. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to do this as fast as I can. I'm gonna I'm go as fast as I possibly can. I keep moving it but I promise you it'll be at the end of the stream and I'll give everybody time to file in. So we've done this, we've done that. We're gonna use these silver case. Yeah, we're gonna use these silver case screws. That's not silver, Chelsea, that is black. And we're gonna use these silver case screws here to screw in the back of this radiator. So I'm gonna just hold this with my thumb and be gentle because there are cables in the back. And we are gonna flip, I could flip this over and do it for y'all that way. Cause I'm holding it up anyway, so why not? Why not? All right, I'm gonna check and make sure that it is lined up the way that I want it lined up. Yes. All right. Symmetrical, clean. Hey, this is the old 11 mini dynamic Lee case. It is all white. We 
are building it up for a giveaway today. We are giving away to everybody who has donated $100 to our charity. They have destroyed the goal at least 10 times now. The Bite Command is amazing. Twitch is amazing. I, I, bro, I'm gonna go to sleep. My heart's so full tonight. All right, now that I got the corners locked in, I'm gonna just finish screwing that in. That is not the right screw. There we go. Thank you. Yo, Betty! Thank you so much for the 50, Betty. It is so great to see you and thank you for supporting Girls Who Code. It really means a lot. Hope you're having a great day. Betty, I, I'm gonna give you, I might give you a TV tonight where uh, everybody who donated $50 is eligible for a whole TV. It's a 50 inch, it's a gaming TV that Vizio has put out. It's nuts. Hope you and Sasha are doing well. Hope you're having a great day. I am, yo, I'm so tired. <laughs> I've been up for days trying to make sure that this whole, we, we put a, this camera is screwed into the wall. And we set up this whole little setup just for this stream. Mwah. It's always great to see you. Let me make sure Mango didn't, there my bag of screws. That's what I needed. All right. I have to do some screw sorting. Might have a screw loose here. Yeah, we're giving away two builds, Betty. They hit 6K. Uh, I'm gonna have to go and gather supplies for the next build. But all the donors who gave away, who gave up $100, they're eligible for both builds. In the next two weeks, I'll get that one done. And they're both gonna be unicorns. So this one's a, kind of a unicorn build, but the next one's gonna be all white gonna be a sight to see. It's my first all white build. <laughs> they do get a third build at 8K, so I could give away three computers. It's very possible. Hey, Townsend, what's good? I think I, I saw you earlier, but welcome back if you left. Hey, Deucer, happy Friday. Great to see you. We are on our first build of the day. I am going to try to speed it up. I have been talking quite a bit, so we just installed and screwed in. See how secure that is? We screwed in our radiator. Now we're gonna gently flip this back over. So this is our progress as of now. Strimmers in, radiator in, CPU paste with the AIO on in. And we are going to plug in our cables. We need to plug in our cables for this pump. Do not be intimidated by these cables. I promise you, they all do a thing. So we're gonna take this USB, I'm gonna plug it into the side of the NZXT pump. This is what's gonna allow you to control it on your computer. <clears throat> and we are going to snake it through the top. So this is where some of that cable management comes in handy. So you're not confused and swimming through cables. We're also gonna plug in our fan controls. Now, now, now. So, so since we're not using the NZXT fans, I am purely plugging this in for power, just this SATA. The rest of this, I will not be plugging in. This is the star, this SATA right here. I know I said now, 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 but I just had to like get my words together. So we're gonna plug that in. This usually controls the fans. You see there are three possible fan controllers and you got the, I think there's also, RGB on this and then you got power but for this purpose we're just doing power so we are also gonna snake this through and I'm gonna try to snake it through the top as well oh 
and we do need to plug the we do need to plug the power in for the pump in the motherboard that is non-negotiable so take this and we are going to plug it in to cpu fan some motherboards or some computers won't start unless you have a cpu fan or it just causes some issues this that and the other so let's snake all of our stuff through the top Yo, genre, thank you so, so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you so, so much for staying a code breaker. Uh, you're asking about the AIO? Yeah, I just did, I already talked about the USB. Uh, if you're asking about the pump, this is the Z63. Yes, this is the Kraken Z63 RGB pump. So it has two fans. We're putting uh, Lee and Lee 140 fans on there, 200 millimeters with an LCD display. I'm gonna try to accommodate you as best as I can. Language barrier or not. Thank you, genre. Thank you so, so much for the love. <laughs> Thank you for supporting the bike command. How are you doing, Cyber? Yeah, we are throwing it back. I'm gonna keep talking and moving, talking and moving. Talking and moving, Chelsea. So I'm, I don't want to turn it all around just yet. I just want to get those cables through. Don't mind me just doing some questionable cable management. So once you wrangle these cables how you like them, then we'll install the RAM because now everything is out of the way. You have a Z73. Lit! Sorry if I peeked. I have... Where's that pump? I only have my, um, I only have an M22 on my shelf and I'm due for another NZXT cooler. I might have to get the Z73. That's lit. We'll back for a moment. Dad will stop being a pain. Hope you don't miss much. Oh, no problem, Nikila. It was funny. I had to fuss at my dad earlier today too. You know, dads. Oh, Chelsea. This has, uh, that, that has something on it. Whoa. How did that get there? All right. I'm gonna take this off. And then let's, let's actually be a professional and do this properly. So this is our... stuff that through for now and then we'll organize it on the other side and then that is the NCXT RGB controller I believe stuff that through as well and we'll pull it all through and make it cute pull it all through and make it cute there we go all of those cables and that last one there you are. Okay, so now as you can tell, the back is starting to spit out. That's why it's important to clean up your wires while you go so you can see what you're doing. And remember, if you're a code breaker, you can request music as we go in. So you can make this whole stream a vibe. You don't have to sit and listen to my playlist. You can, you can do whatever you want. All right. Now that we've done that, we're gonna go ahead and install the RAM. We've got 32 gigs of RAM. Each stick is eight. We've got four. They're the Dominator Platinum RGB. They are thick. Yeah, all the code breakers in the chat, everybody who subscribed, you can definitely, I used to, everybody who's new to me, uh, hi, I'm Chelsea Bites, I used to, let people use song requests for free. So you can guess how that went. I did it for like a week. <laughs> I'd be like, what? why is this song so weird? I, I didn't even register like, oh yeah. <laughs> hey, thank you so much. I appreciate you. Is that the green lawyer online? It went left. Oh yeah. 
It was Ram Ranch all the time. <laughs> so yeah, don't do that. It's okay to put your song requests behind a wall. I think follower, followers only is still a little too lax. So I'm taking the tape off of this Dominator, off of this Dominator Ram, and we are about to bully this AIO real fast. So I'm gonna start in here. Um, I noticed that I had to boot this up first. I first had to boot this up with just two ram sticks so if that happens today it's fine we're just gonna take it down we're gonna remove those ram sticks but it should be good it should be fine we're just gonna it's straightforward we're just gonna install those All right. it's okay to be a little a little mean to your ram all right Make sure you're installing it properly, but really push it in until you hear that click and you see that bracket close on it. Yeah, I like how these look. They're very fancy. <laughs> exactly, Joker. They were like, oh, here's the, you know, most dirtiest song I can find. I'm like, okay. All right. And I was just oblivious. It was like my first week on Twitch in 2018. We've been doing this for four years now. Everybody who's been around that long, it's been four years. What about the blue lawyer? Okay. <laughs> Everything's so different than the last time I messed. Oh, than the last time I messed like this with. What's so different, Nikila? What's so different about it? What happened? All right, last stick, slide that sucker in. The next thing we need to do, we're gonna put in the SATA box. It is officially five o'clock. Let's see if I can do the rest of this. Like we got the CPU, uh oh, there we go. Got the CPU, we just about got the RAM. Really it's just the fans and things at this point other than all the sticky icky wires in the GPU. I like doing the GPU last. It feels very rewarding. I'm gonna go ahead and plug in the motherboard streamer. It's right there. You know, it's just right there. <laughs> like that Whataburger skit. It's right there, you know? Uh, if it gives me a problem later, I will unplug it. I keep my hair, man. All right, there we go. I need you to hold this cable for me. Thank you. Boom. All right, if the camera goes wild, it's because I'm touching it. I wanna go, oh my gosh, is it? <laughs> what song is playing? I don't know what, I'm not listening to y'all's Wow, Ray, really? Ray, really? You did this, Onyx? Y'all jamming to this right now? Oh, Nikila, you had the very thin ram. <sighs> Cackle, huh? Y'all just laughing. Y'all are hilarious. Hilarious, I tell you. Y'all really got jokes. Just want that to be known. All right, so we've done the RAM. So now we got a little extra special thing that we have to do. We are gonna put in this SATA box, this internal USB hub in ZXT. has this really cool hub that allows you to split a USB 2.0 port on your motherboard into four. We're only going to need two. And it's pretty impressive how they've done this. It's okay to use scissors, y'all. Don't try to use a finger for everything. All right, all right, all right. So we are going to install this hub. We're gonna install it in the back. So let's go ahead and just flip this over now. Cause everything in here has been screwed down in the front. So now we can confidently flip this over and I'm gonna clear out all of this extra garbage. All right. Keep your station clear. 
okay? It's the mark of a great chef. Keep your station clear. Y'all, that's my favorite movie. I love Ratatouille so much, I'm sorry. I know it's a meme, but it's really, it's Disney's top movie, all right? You can't tell me different. Thank you, Nikki. <laughs> Yo, this, that hit, what you mean? I'm sick, psychotic. Oh, dear, cyber, really? Oh, oh my God. <sighs> Y'all are wild. Wild. All right, I'm gonna move the screws over here just in case I need them. Come on, Chelsea, you can put this build together. Look at he split. So this is this is new for me. I might have to take some learning and read some things. So this looks like the hub itself. Okay, so this is the hub. That's pretty clean. You did that in ZXT. This is actually a really niche item that I did not expect to see in such clean packaging. So this is our motherboard USB that we're gonna plug in and then we're gonna spawn off two more USBs so we can use the strimmer box, the fan controller, and the pump all on the same motherboard. We just need to plug in, this needs to use the last SATA. This is just gonna take up one more SATA and we're set. If I put two RX 562 gigabytes on one PC, will I have four? No. <laughs> hmm? Yeah. Yeah. It has everything it needs. No, listen to this. If I put two RX 562 gigs in one PC, will I have four gigs of video memory? I just, I just, I don't think it works like that. It, it's, it's, it's just the amount of work you're gonna have to run those things in tandem. It's, it's not gonna meet that full four. It's not, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, I mean, is it better than, is it better than one? Just try it out. If you have the tools to plug all that in and you test and see if it runs better, then hey, you 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 tell us. I've never done I've never done that before. Not with two RX fifties. I mean five sixties. A little space heater just just heating up. <sighs> oh, two GPUs. Imagine. Okay, so this I believe is magnetic. It is. So this is really cool because you just boop and it stays. It stays. So try to keep it on something metal and give it some room to breathe. I think the smartest spot for it is right underneath this HDD cage. I'm gonna try to keep it vertical. I'm gonna try to keep it vertical. I, I like it here, I like it here because if something sits on top of this, it's not going to completely crush it. And if I wanna move it, I'll just move it around. And in fact, maybe it's best. I'm gonna just slide this through for now and then we'll, we'll wait to plug everything else in and then we'll find a spot for it to live. So for now, let's just leave it there. Plug it in at the very last SATA because we're gonna need the rest of those SATA ports. And yeah, this should solve our other crisis. Good. How you doing? Oh, is there? Wait, hold on. Oh, this band. Yeah, it's so I don't uh, short everything on my motherboard. You ground yourself. Uh, it's much better if you use it on your ankle so you don't have to think about it. But I put it on my wrist and I put, I put some, I, I use this to connect it to something metal and that grounds you so you don't short anything. It's very useful if you have a lot of carpet or static in your home, so you have no risk of doing that. Thank you all so much for donating. If I missed a dono, I am sorry. I think the last dono we got was from Betty. Thank you, Betty, again for donating 
to Girls Who Code. If we hit $8,000, I'll be giving away a third PC. This is our first PC that we're giving away. We're gonna set up for that second build in a couple of weeks. So hang out, especially if you, if you are a $100 donor. All right, so we installed that SATA box. So this is gonna be the sticky part. We are going to install the fan controller and we're gonna be installing the uh, streamer box. So this fan controller is gonna take every fan in our computer and it's gonna put it all in here to control. Now, because we have USB to our streamer box, we're not gonna put it in here. We are just going to install the USB for the SATA. So we don't, at first, <laughs> We were gonna need all of this, which we will still need some of it, but we don't need to plug in this controller here at the end. So that means this contraption that I've made to convert our lights, we will just be plugging in to our streamer here. So let's get started. I think instead of doing that though, I'm going to go ahead and just install I'm just going to install our fans. I think our fans come first, right? I think you guys would agree. Fans come first. So we're gonna install our fans one at a time. And we are going to start cable managing this, this case. All right, so this is all, oh, we need to install the SATA here. Right. This is where all my time gets taken up. It's, it's managing these cables, truly. So I'm gonna tie this down because it is wild. Yeah, I know. Cables aren't cute, but they're necessary, you know? 20 minutes, what can I do in 20 minutes? You know what I can do in 20 minutes? I can start up my playlist. And that's what I can do. And get some more music on the go. If I if, if I can do that. If you're like me, I gotta play the same songs over and over again. There we go. Please share your builds in the chat. Talk nerdy to me. <laughs> you have black NZXT X6. Look at you. I usually do a black build. This is my first light build. It's never been this light. The first computer we gave away to the community was called Nebula because it was all black and it was blue. It looked like a galaxy. I miss them. I miss Nebula, but it went to a great home. My job is kind of bittersweet because I have to build them, but I, you know, I don't keep them. I give them away. Thank you for the hug, Randy. I appreciate it. Hey! I got you, 88 Glam, builds.gg. I usually use a PC part picker. Do you ever have time? Uh, do you ever time yourself? I do, Ray, every stream. Um, this one's gonna be kind of harder because I paused a lot. But I think the fastest build I did was like two hours live. I'm gonna beat myself sometime. Like I would love to get a build done. I'm pretty sure I could get a build done in an hour. I just feel like I could. But because I talk so much, it feels nigh impossible from time to time. Okay, so we've managed up some of those cables. It looks a little less intimidating. We've got our AIO plugged in. We'll be doing our NZXT plug next. But for now, we're gonna go fan by fan. And I think we should start with the 140s. So what's really cool about these Lian Lee fans, you can take them and you can connect them. And for anybody who's used Lee and Lee fans, 
you know how convenient that is because once they connect they have these cool little bars here that connect them and they communicate it is the first of its kind and genius and that's why I love using them all right so now we are going to push all of that other stuff back we are going to get our radiator case screws we don't have any silver screws for this we do have to use the black screws we're gonna start screwing that in you only have four I mean four gets it done you have four on your motherboard like in your RAM or on your GPU because four on your GPU is not bad I'd like eight if it was like your uh, random access memory on your motherboard eight's more fun you need a PC hey Luffy uh, we're giving this one away uh, for everybody who donates hundred dollars for girls who code they will be getting a chance to win this computer because they were so generous to donate during our charity week. We've raised over $7,000. If we hit 8K, y'all, we could give away a third computer. Y'all are wild. We got to, we hit a stretch, 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 stretch goal of 6K and then y'all went up like another thousand. Yeah, I sealed my computer inside a blacked out quiet case. Can't even remember what size cooler I put it. It's either a 280 or a 360. Did you put two fans or three in? I feel like if you put three, then you probably had a 360, right? All right. You cannot remember. <laughs> All of the money goes to girls who code. They absolutely do need it. You're absolutely right. Hop on in. Oh, and before I forget, don't do like me where I literally explain all of the benefits of using these fans and then not showing you the full benefits of that fan. When you plug these together, make sure to install this wonderful doohickey right here. This is what's gonna allow you to communicate with your fans oh and the configuration <laughs> so your fan configuration is very important understand the flow of your computer so the goal here we are going to bring air into the computer from the bottom and we are going to push it out from the top so this is always, always a struggle for me. So I always, I always leave it as a note, but air is going to come through this way. So the fans need to be installed like this in the configuration that I am doing today. And before we screw any of that down, <laughs> uh, usually the air comes towards the, the, the nice side or the label of the fan and it'll hit you from this direction so remember air goes through this way so since we want to pull air into the case we're going to install it this way so always look at what kind of configurations you can get for your computer what type of uh, flow you want don't make a hot box do not burn your parts up you will cry i promise you'll be like oh my god why is my computer so hot in a bad way and, and and that's why because you know like you you didn't put it in right all right let's drag it through yeah that part remember y'all we are still raising money for charity all the way up to the end of this stream before I screw this in though, I am gonna make sure I can bring the cables through. And actually before I screw any of this in, because once we start screwing all this stuff in, it's gonna be harder to move, I'm gonna go ahead and set up the next set of fans. These will also look like this, because they'll be bringing air into the computer. I 
there we go. So just, it should click in like that. And just slide. See, now we've got three. Then we're gonna take another one of these and we're gonna slide it on so we can also communicate with this set of fans. Let's do this fast. We can get this build done before six o'clock, I know that. All right, so that's in proper. I'm gonna turn it this way. So we have a chance to keep all the cables organized. So it'll face this way. I'm gonna gently put this down. Snart. We're gonna start snaking the cables in. I'll put them through the bottom so we can keep track. I will tie these cables off so we can tell whose cables go where, what, why, all that. All right, all right, perfect. All right, let's start sliding stuff around carefully. I'm gonna drag these through because those are very important cables. This is the hard part. Keeping everything clean. I installed some fans like this one time and I completely screwed everything in. Then I looked down and all the cables were behind the fan, so I had to take my work apart. That was a learning lesson. All right, that looks so much better. All right, and then you. You're holding this up, but that doesn't mean you gotta look ugly. You can look cute, regardless of the situation. All right, all right. All those cables are sitting in nicely. I'm gonna go ahead and set this up so everything's sitting and then we can screw everything else in. Where is all the air gonna go out? At the top. It's going to exhaust from the top since heat rises. You want to not fight the flow of heat. So think about where all of your heat is going to build up. We're gonna have a GPU right here in the middle of the computer. So as it gets warmer, the CPU gets warmer, the power supply is also at the top. As that gets warmer, we're gonna use the air, the cool air from the bottom of the computer, drag it up and push the heat out quickly so you can dissipate it quickly and keep everything cool. Right, don't fight the flow. Don't fight the flow of your computer. That's truly like the one piece of advice I can give you today is don't fight your computer. <laughs> is that a push-pull? Um, it's a, it's a configuration. I would like to say it's a pull-push because that's what makes sense to me. The first set of fans I installed were the pull. But please look it up. <laughs> For me, it's ultimately like, what am I achieving with this configuration? Every one of them looks different. It's a pull? Thanks, Mingo. I thought it was a pull. Right, don't fight it. <laughs> one layer of fans. So I'm gonna screw this in so I can give myself some room to breathe. Can stand up on its own, be a little more independent. Don't need mama bites to hold it up no more. It's a strong independent radiator that doesn't need any support. Okay, I see you, I see you. I'm getting there, I'm getting there. Promise. All right, all right. All right, I'm gonna install this last corner down here. You're pulling air in from the bottom and pulling air in from the side and exhausting, yeah. What an SOS pulled fork. I'm sick of you, SOC. Thanks, Indigo. 
Thanks, Mango, for teaching us stuff. I know I've disappeared from the camera, but I promise I'm here. What? They always say it toes back in the day. The computer's actually stupid and only understands one and zero. So you have to help the stupid thing be amazing. Yeah. People are always so afraid of like a robot, like takeover. And I don't know why, because the computer has to be as smart as us. I mean, I'm not really worried about us taking over the world anytime soon. Yeah, we can make really stupid decisions, but I don't think the robots are gonna get us anytime soon. Cause we made them. <laughs> yeah. Humans, am I right? I think I've got this. Yes, I've got that. All right, so the radiator is half installed. The strimmer has its spot. These cables can actually be can serve to be pushed in a little more, but they're in. Cable management is looking all right. Strimmer's not being too aggressive, so now we're going to flip this over since everything's in place. I'm gonna take our K screws, our silver K screws. What is that? Ah, something under here. There we go. We're gonna get as many silver K screws as we can get. Oh, actually no, we're gonna use these screws, the Leanne Lee screws that came with each fan. And we are gonna screw those in. I think y'all can see that. All right, so you don't have to go too tight on these because you'll just strip them. Just do it tight enough so that it holds in. Otherwise, you're just gonna be twisting and twisting and twisting. Just twist just enough. Don't overdo it with the Lee and Lee's. All right, look at that. Be gentle with them and they'll do what you say. Thanks, Deucer. <laughs> Wash that scent off. Yo, Keys gotta be put in the corner every day. <laughs> every day, Keys has his own corner, bro. For you and me. Ooh, speaking of a shower, I'm gonna take a whole bath tonight. It's that, it's that kind of day. I need a whole bath. I'm I'm gonna pass out, y'all. I haven't slept in days. It's been a busy, this was my busiest week of the month. Yeah, B, no, it's fine. You know, I'm just gonna sleep. I'm just gonna sleep real good. It's a good, it's a good sleep, you know? It's a very good sleep. It's a job well done. You guys went ham today. And I can't thank you enough. Yeah, speaking of twisting. There we go. Must have the same thread on there. Right? Oh, Lord. There we go. Yeah, showers. I learned that you should do, like, cold showers, like, once in a while. I don't know why. I'm not a doctor, but I heard they're good for you. Warm showers help circulate your blood. They relax your muscles. You know, I love a hot shower. Apparently, my showers are too hot. I apparently bathe in the pits of hell, according to Mango. My water's just too hot. <laughs> I think Mango just has baby skin, but that's just my opinion, you know? I could be wrong. Maybe I am just on fire. 
You can't do hot water other than petties? Bro, my showers have to make me feel like I can feel like the sun itself. That's how it has to feel for me to feel like I'm taking an actual shower. I have to come out of my shower red. put the filter there so nothing comes out all right all of that is installed let's get that filter and we did the appropriate configuration the air is going to pull into the case Now, if I can remember how to slide this sucker in. It goes this way, not that way, Chelsea. There we go. All right, everything is secured in. We are gonna flip this back over now that that is solid. Fans are in, and now we can actually start plugging in some of these fans. So this is really important, keeping up with these controllers. I'm gonna start with our fan controller, we are going to need our tape. So we're gonna tape this down, but we're gonna be very smart about it. We don't want it on the radiator because then it'll get heated up by the radiator. And that would be very bad. Now, we got fans that are gonna go at the top. So this is the side and then this is the bottom. So we're gonna plug the radiator fans in slot two because we want, the order that you plug this stuff in is very important because that's the order it will light up your fans. So we are going to plug the radiator fans in slot two. We are going to plug the bottom fans in slot three because we are only gonna be plugging in three things in this controller box, this fan controller box. Yeah, I want to feel like lava. Apparently, protein. I learned that women apparently just take hot showers. And I I think I think y'all just we're just built different, I guess. Just really trying to get whatever the day had off of us. So the slot that we're gonna install on number one, it's gonna be our top and our back fan because we want it to move in a circle almost. We want it to be either clockwise or counterclockwise. We want it synchronous. We want it in order. So it's very important that we take, we take care of that order. So now that these tables are taken care of, we're gonna screw them together to keep them in order so they don't get all tangled up. I'm just gonna shorten them a bit. And we'll do some cable management at the end of this stream. 30 minutes, Chelsea, 30 minutes. I just wanna show y'all want to boot it up that's all I want to do is boot this thing up and we're gonna install the SATA I'm going to install it in the third slot because I want to install no I'm gonna install in the second I'm gonna put the streamer box in the third all right so I know it doesn't look it but all of my cables are sorted so I can come back through and make them prettier in just a bit. But we are gonna go ahead. It is about time. In a bit, we are going to plug in the NZXT hub so we can use both of our controller and our streamer box. This is our streamer box. I'm gonna go ahead and peel the plastic off of that. I'm not gonna need that. This is also USB, so you see we have two USB. And we're gonna plug this into SATA as well for power. And that means all of our SATA have been used. Everything should be powered up. We're gonna take those cables from our streamers 
So I believe this should be our motherboard. Yep. And we're going to plug this in here. Or actually, instructions. Our motherboard, I believe, goes up top. And then our GPU, our VGA cables go to the side. But I will check the motherboard before I boot it on. Always, always, always when it comes to powered things, check. You don't want to look up and burn something out. That'll also make you cry. And that's the last thing I want for you, is for you to cry while you're building your computer. Now, I know this seems like a lot, and it kinda is, but when you organize your cables, promise, promise, it'll get that much more easy to understand. So we don't need to plug this in to this case or to this anymore because we have it to where it's being controlled by USB. So this does not need to attach to our fan controller. Never forget the smell. That would make me cry. No, I'm not Randy, but I'd like to meet them. You're going to cry anyway, Teddy. Why? You don't need to cry. Don't cry. That just make me sad. I'd be like, God dang it. Teddy's crying. What am I supposed to do? And since I don't need to connect this, I'm going to remove this for now. Maybe it'll help us with our cable management just a bit. I'll put it, well, shoot, can I remove it? Actually, no, I'm going to leave this one. I'm not going to fight this one. I'm not gonna fight it. Sometimes cables put in and they don't come out. It's there, it's meant to stay. It's just your life, just crying. You know, Teddy, one day we just gonna smile, okay? I promise, we're just gonna smile. So I'm gonna go ahead and preemptively plug these in to our USB on our NZXT. Plug our SATA back in. So now we have the room. And then, there's one more cable. There it is. Nothing insinuating that there's an in out. All right. Plug that in. We are giving this computer away today to one of our donors. If you have donated $100, Please, please, please be here around the end of the stream so you have a chance to win. It would make me no, nothing would make me happier than giving back to the people who did good. Just really appreciate y'all. Y'all are, y'all are freaking stellar. So this NZXT is magnetic, which I love because it makes it so much easier for me to place. So I just need to find a spot. Honestly, could slide it in. Right here, I don't have a HDD, but because we're actually, we're, we're good programmers here, we're not going to do that. I'm going to put it somewhere where it won't get crushed, but it's also convenient and doesn't get in the way of anything else. So it's going to stick there. I'm going to make sure it's strong. I want a strong connection. I feel very quotable tonight. I don't know why. Oh, man. Okay. And because I can already see this in a little bit of an issue, we're going to snake it under these cables to keep it clean. All right. All right. Now, yes, yeah, some of these are going to flip a little bit. They're going to fall, but that is okay because we will deal with that. When we get to it, we are gonna take this. It's it's shy, it's shy, but we'll get it. Let's actually flip it a little bit. It's a little shy, but we're gonna we're gonna get it out of its shell. Oh yeah, 
You're gonna, you're, you're going to the party. Okay, you can't hide from me. There we go. Not to say, get out here in your best dress. Spent so much money on this. All right. So we just installed our NZXT USB splitter. Mango, you gotta come sing for everybody. I didn't forget. All right. Boom, boom, bada bop, boom, bow. There's one thing, one little thing. There you are. This needs to be plugged in too, so we're gonna plug in the USB. Honestly, we could plug all of this in right here, but we're gonna keep it stable. Mango, they said that you, when we hit goal, you were supposed to sing for us at 5K. Remember you said you would. You don't remember all of a sudden? I remember. You gotta come in here and sing to them on that really nice mic that we got. I didn't sign you up. You were like, yeah. You're like, yeah, I could sing. Cause at first you were like 50K for a face reveal. And they were like, nah. And they were like, you can sing. And you were like, okay. And then you even started singing in the chat. Not actually singing, but you were singing in the chat itself. So, you know, you know. Just saying, come on through. All right, the fan controller, trimmer box installed. Let's finish installing these fans. Let's install these fans. This is the fun part. Oh, my neck. You know, that felt amazing. Just getting that out. All right, these are our last sets of fans. Let's get these done quick. It's already 540. Now the labels are going to face in like this because the air is gonna pull the, the fans are gonna pull the air out. So it'll be facing the opposite direction of our other fans. And that is the pull push configuration. All right, that fits there. Let's get this. So, let's explain this. <laughs> this, of course, looks like a mess, just a bit. But there's reason to this. So this is gonna go to this set of fans right here. Let me track it, because the order is very important. All right, so this one, this is the main pin, the main uh, splitter for this. It's gonna go on this set of fans, because that's the order we want it in. So what we want to do, we want to join the back fan and the fans on top. Oh, but now that we have room, Mango, now that we have room, we don't have to do this. Like truly, we don't have to do this. So this whole, this that we did, now that we have room, we don't have to do any of this. So uh, I take back everything I said. We are going to undo the work that we did so diligently for y'all. And we are just gonna do it normal like and take these extra splitters off. <laughs> Goodbye splitters. It's great knowing you. Truly. Don't 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 strip the mesh, Chelsea. Just just take this off. Alright.
Boom. And we're just gonna do it like a normal build. Hey Keys, welcome back. How was the shower? Yeah, now we got spare parts, Mickle. That's the best part. Can use that later when we need it. But thanks to NZXT popping off there, we don't have to do that. All right, so we're gonna install this normally. We're gonna install this to the back, plug this into that controller and plug that into that controller. Have to deal with less cables. It's a wonderful time. And actually, I'm gonna install the back fan first so we have room to mess around with cables. And that's good because we have these. Thought I'd drop that. Put that there, put that there. That's questionable, Chelsea, but don't worry about it. Of course, it's okay because it fell through to the bottom. Actually, that's where I'm gonna leave those. So now we're gonna screw these in. I'm gonna flip it. Install it well. There we go, that's pretty even. <laughs> Skip the songs until we get the right one. It's Friday, y'all gotta be like the best DJs out there. Friday night DJ is supposed to be the best. Yeah, it's the pull port configuration. I'm, that's what we're gonna call it. All right, everybody, we did the pull port configuration. It's lit, it's live. Can't wait to boot this thing up. I know I'm moving like molasses, but honestly, I'm, I'm doing this build. We really started at like four o'clock, you know? Like we really start, I don't know, I, I don't know when I started. I'll be around like 3.30. 3.45, I, I don't remember. I know I talked a lot. I tend to do that. Put that is in. Let's put these here. So you can actually see them. Yeah, that part. <laughs> hey, welcome in. We're just setting up some cables. We just installed the back fan. And we did that first because we don't want to compete with the top fan. And I'm going to cradle this thing for a second so y'all can kind of see what I'm doing here. I'm just taking these power and RGB cables, slide them through the top so they have somewhere to access the back. Six o'clock, Chelsea, six o'clock. All right, now we are gonna snake the cables. I'm gonna turn this around so it's easier and it looks better. Which means now I actually have to pay attention. I do need to pay attention to which fan cables these are. And hey, however your cable management, as long as it works, there's no shame in your game, all right? Not everything is perfect. Sometimes it just is what it is. Just make sure it makes sense to you the next time you open it back up. That's the important part. The last thing you want is to open up and you're like, what? What was I thinking? Or you look at it on the inside and you're like, ew, <laughs> what is that?
right? Sometimes you just gotta get it in there. Yeah, and you're not gonna look at it for like at least a few months, right? Like, no judge. I like that once you get like one screw in, you can just let it go. Cause they're all connected nicely. Let's get the rest of those cables. Those are the 140s. Let's not use those. Oh, can I have some screws, please? Can I have some screws? Just need some screws. Can I have screws? Oh, actually, maybe I do need to open up the... Uh... There they are. There are some screws. There's two of them. I think we're set. And we need that tape because we're gonna have to tape those on there. So these are about to be very important very soon. Well, not that, but this is, and another one when I grab it. I just realized how many fans you have. How many fan headers does this motherboard have? So, dang it. So, um, we have three, nine fans, and the great thing about Lee and Lee fans is that they all connect together. You can literally slide them together and they communicate. So it reduces the amount of, of cables that come off of that set. So technically I'm treating this like I have four fans and this controller back here can control four sets of fans. So uh, I think there's a certain amount of uh, fans that each like a total amount of fans that it could control. I think it's up to like 12 or 16 or something like that. But that's uh, Lee and Lee. They really thought that through. So I'm dealing with four sets of cables besides the streamers. And then in order to use the USB 2.0 slots on this motherboard in tandem with three separate USB devices, we have the NZXT. USB splitter and it splits it into four USB 2.0 ports. Right now we're just screwing in the top fans and it's gonna pull air out from the top and pull air out from the back, which is what we want because we're pulling air in from the bottom, all the cool air. So we can cool our computer down efficiently and I should provide the temps on this once we get everything all laid down. Almost done with the unicorn, guys. Yeah, Cyber, we be working on it. Y'all got Friday plans though? What's going on? What are y'all doing for fun tonight? I know I'm gonna watch episode four of House of the Dragon. It's gonna be great. I'm going to literally take a dirt nap after that. We're missing one. Where is it missing? I need two. I thought I just had a full bag of them. Strange. You know, when you uh, build computers, you'll learn very quickly that you're really good at making things disappear you will somehow become a magician and it's very involuntary you'll just do magic without meaning to it's a it's a process I would like to have those screws thank you very oh I had oh they were silver Oh, Chelsea, okay. I'm gonna replace all of these with the silver after the stream. And I'm just gonna fill these in with two silver. I, I wanted to screw in all the stuff with silver when I could. And I just realized I had silver caps here. There we go, okay. Don't worry, person who wins this computer, it'll look right. 
right? There, 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 there. That's all in. Let's finish putting in. We're gonna finish putting in these radiator screws because we're supposed to do that. Oh, about nine of them in to go. There are nine fans. Have you ever seen the Leanne Lee Dunn case? I haven't. SLC, that'd be really cool. You know what I'd also like to see in person? The Leanne Lee desk. Uh, yeah, the Leanne Lee desk case. With uh, the big one. With two computers. That would be freaking cool. A dirt nap, Andrew. I'm dead. I'll be back to give away the second computer, I promise. How they connected to the motherboard. So, let's explain that. All of these fans, they have two cables that come off of them for power and for RGB control. They plug into the fan controller in the back. That fan controller then connects to a USB 2.0 header on the motherboard and other things like SATA to power it. And that's how it's all controlled. So USB 2.0, SATA, and uh, yeah, yeah, that's, that's it. That's ultimately what comes in contact with the motherboard. Yeah, no Molex. I haven't used Molex in a long time. That I think my first build you'd mo use Molex and I haven't used it since, but it's, it can be very useful. Hey, how you doing? Is that Taco? What's going on, Taco? Tariki, thank you for the $5. Yo, thank you so much for the support. Thank you for pushing our goal up. I'll be giving away a third computer at 8K, and you guys have less than $800 to do so. Y'all, y'all put in. $7,000 in the span of five days, less than 24 hours, because I didn't stream that much this week. I streamed every day, but not that much. Whew. So if anybody out there would love the option to get a third computer, we're giving this one away today. This is our first one. Lucky winner will get it really soon. You know, if I hurry my butt up. Sorry, y'all gotta work with uh, y'all gotta work with uh, tired out Chelsea. I can feel my eyes falling apart. All right, that's in. That's in. That's in. Front panel is in. All the fans are in. Strimmers are in. I think the last thing we gotta do is make sure all the stuff is plugged in for our fans. <laughs> it sounds so funny to say that, our fans. Let's take that out of here. All right. So one and two. So this is one. I think I found the appropriate configuration for these fans. <laughs> I'm glad to hear it amazing. I'm almost done. Oh, once those rooster teeth checks come in after they put you on a show, you'll be. <laughs> Thank you, SOC. I appreciate that. Yo, we're gonna nail this. We're gonna get the rooster teeth project. Our first assignment is to make a podcast. Uh, what would y'all like to hear a podcast about? What do y'all like to listen to? I love nerdy stuff. 
like role playing and all that. But I know people like to listen to a wide range. So I'm curious. Doc is our resident podcaster. He put me on Safari. So I gotta get to listening. Sorry if y'all are listening to music. I got my own set of music just for this. All right. SATA, just checking one more time. That's to USB. All of the fans are plugged in. Streamers are plugged in. We got USB and we got SATA there. (sighs) GPU. Put the GPU in. I think we are ready to just about finish this build. Let's get that GPU. We're putting in the vision, y'all. It's a 3000 series GPU, it's a 3070 vision. Oh, yep. It is getting plugged in right now. And we are just gonna boot it up and we're gonna call that time. Yeah, it's six o'clock, but we are just about finished. Thank y'all for being so patient with my build. I'm a very distracted builder, so I had to put some music in to stay focused. The main event. How you doing? It's great to see you. Hey, intern. How was your day? It's great to see you. Hope you're having a wonderful time. We are finishing up this build. We are doing it. We are killing it. Hopefully nothing burns or melts to a crisp, you know. Wouldn't that be content? I promise we will send you a working build. If you watch this computer go up in smoke, I promise you. Oh man, it it has nothing on you. I promise we will fulfill our promise. Okay. Y'all. I mean, look at it. It's pretty shaped up. Cables look clean. Might be a little bit of pulling I have to do here and there. But I would definitely call that cleaned up. We'll do the back. I think, I think it's time to turn it on. Uh, I can close up the back late. I should close up the back now. No, I'm not even gonna pretend. I'm gonna do a little bit of cable management before we boot it up. But I am not going to do too much because if there are any issues, then we're going to cry about it. All right. That is there. That is there. That is there. We are simply going to put the back on it. That's it. We're just going to put the back on it. Just so we can see what it looks like on the morrow. I mean, on the back. All right. So. This case is pretty interesting. You've got your dust filters here and it has these rubber stops and you use those rubber stops. You put them, you fit them right in the hole that they're in and then you slide it in. I'm gonna have to use some elbow grease and make sure it's, it's properly placed. Oh, well, that'll do it. We won't run it long. So I'm gonna come back and finish up with these cables later and we'll take some nice pictures. But for now, I just need it all to sit. Then I'll go back through with that shroud. And then I'll place the tape on there. I just wanna make sure it boots. I think it's good practice for you to you know, check it before you screw it all in because you don't want 
to screw everything down and then you have an issue. And you're just stuck there like, what am I supposed to, what am I gonna do? I think it's fully in though. Let's go ahead and screw it in. Yeah, they're like a million fans. Thank you, E-Knight. Yeah, I think it's a build. It's under charity. Honestly, my mind is gone. <laughs> I can't even see. Yes, SOC, I have no idea what y'all are listening to. I'm glad y'all think it's funny, though. Have fun, you know? Enjoy your stream. Enjoy it. There you go, there's the build. Thank you, E-Knight. Thank you so much for supporting the bike command. It means a lot. I'm gonna switch out these because these just don't, they don't match that. There we go. Whew. Standing in this spot, man. Makes your shoulders something fierce. There you are. My eyes are like, Please, please go to sleep. Oh, thanks. <laughs> that is funny. Y'all got jokes. All right, y'all. Put the glass and everything all in it. Chelsea. How are they supposed to use the build if you can't? put it in oh that's why that's like that I see I see okay wow that's different don't mind my hair you know just uh, passing through there we go you do need those screws Just want to make the back the back side is secure, so I'm gonna lay it down. You guys can watch it boot up. I'm gonna make it super super tight. Put that into everything. Let's clear it all out. Make sure to keep the CPU cover, please. If you win, I want you to be able to, you know, turn it in if you need to fix something or something breaks. All right. SSD installed. And we've got light. <sighs> Y'all ready? It's 607. Motherboard lit up. Let's face the music. It's beautiful. It's my little unicorn. <sighs> oh, I touched the top. You can flip this image in the NZXT software. G the GPU's lighting up, the RAM's lighting up, fans, all fans are spinning. Streamers are on. This is great. Air is being pulled and air is being pushed. In, out, bruh. We did that. It looks amazing, right? I, wow, I'm really jealous. <laughs> I want this RAM. I want this motherboard. So you have room 
to throw in a capture card on this motherboard. This very much can be a creator capture, I mean, a creator build. Thank you so much, Asus, for coming through and giving us this motherboard. If you would like to stream on this, you could do so. You can do just about anything. You can add more SSDs. You can add more HDDs. There's plenty of space in the cage in the back. I will be doing my cable management. I'll keep it as clean as I can for you. I mean, it's about time to get to that giveaway. Thank you so much, DTS, for making this charity possible. Thank you, Vizio. Thank you, Asus. And thank you, thank you so much for everyone in this chat supporting us and allowing us to support Girls Who Code. We went way, way over our goal. You guys are awesome. I'm glad you're here, Doc. I see you, I see you. We have raised over $7,000, $7,000 today. We raised $7,413 from an original $500 goal. Y'all are awesome. Y'all are, y'all are awesome. Are y'all BTS fans? My sister is. I should send her like a vinyl or something. <laughs> y'all killed it. I'm gonna cry later. I'll cry later. But now it's time to get to that giveaway. It's time to spend. It's been a long day. I appreciate you guys coming through, making this happen. Thank you so much. DTS, Vizio, Asus, and more. And all of you guys donating over $7,000 for charity. And thank you for making all this possible. Y'all are lit. Thank you, thank you so much, Asus. Thank you, thank you so much, Vizio. Thank you, thank you so much, DTS. And thank you for donating to Girls Who Code. Go, 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 go. Let's see who wins this. Three, two, one. Let's go. It's... Flicker effect! Yo! You did that! Congratulations! You got pulled first for the first tier and you said no! I'm in it to win big! And you kept going! And you won! Congratulations! Woo! Thank you, thank you so much for not only only donating over a hundred dollars a hundred dollars for being here to support our charity let's go make sure to hit me up for all the details so we can send you the unicorn thank y'all so much now we will be doing another giveaway very soon in the next few weeks so stick around if you would like to win unicorn 2.0 Everybody who has donated $100 will be doing a separate giveaway just for y'all. No BS. We're just going straight through the names. It won't be the build up like this, but we'll be building it live and we'll be giving it away then. So if you have donated $100, we'll be giving another computer out. Thank y'all so much. It's coming all out of my pocket. It's a Chelsea Bite special. All me. So if you'd like to pick some parts, if you want it to be AMD or Intel, if you want a 3080 Ti, a 3070, join the Discord, hit me up in the tech center and let me know, or in Codebreaker HQ, and we'll make it happen. It's been a long week. Thank you guys so much. I know you don't envy me right now. It always hate, you know, it's always hard being the bearer of uh, gifts. <laughs> but thank you all for being gracious and charitable and very very beautiful people overall thank you thank you thank you for donating thank you for being awesome i can't wait to catch y'all for the next build we're gonna go show some love i'm gonna go lay down y'all you think you're in pain oh my god my eyes my back my fingers like it computers draw blood like i'm i'm i have cuts my eyes burn my back 
I'm gonna go and disappear for the next few weeks <laughs> and I'm going to try to uh, get back together for the next one. We're gonna make it happen. I'll be tweeting about it, so follow me on Twitter if you wanna keep up with the giveaways. Also follow me on Discord if you wanna talk further about what you'd like in your potential computer. And um, thank you all again, seriously. I do not take the amount that you donated lightly. Y'all donated over $7,000. Y'all are nuts. Y'all are absolutely nuts. Thank you so much. Seriously, like it, that, that is, it's, it hasn't even been like 24 hours and y'all pulled together $7,000. Thank you for being awesome. I'm gonna go and, I'm gonna go and lay down. Um, if y'all are up at 8.30, we'll be watching House of the Dragon in the Discord. Probably at 8, actually. I'll, I'll give myself some time. 8 o'clock, we'll be hopping in to watch that. Thank you again. Y'all are awesome. Y'all be good making good choices. Let me take y'all out. Yeah, let me do that. Ooh, please email us if you won. All right. Unless you have a Sound Unbound code, please email us if you won Tier 2 through 4 gifts. That's the only way we're going to be able to send you the stuffs. Whew. Anybody else? Anybody else hot? Anybody? Thank you for all of our new kilobytes. Welcome to the Bite Command. Thank you so, 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 so much for all the love. Thank you for our mods keeping us together today, especially. Thank you for our bit lords, our hacktivists. Thank you, Odias, for popping off. Thank you for our new code breakers and our returning code breakers. Y'all are awesome. Thank you for our hosts, our raids, our hacktivists, our bit king, and our gift bot. You guys made today's giveaway special. I'm going to go and brag about y'all to the ends of the earth now. I appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Y'all be good. Make good choices and have a great weekend. I may see you Monday unless my brain has exploded. Bye, guys. Good night. Love y'all. See you next week.